Hi, it's me Ellen. Today I want to give a little um, WordPress beginners tip again and today I show you how you can create custom menus in WordPress in the customizer. So if I go on my test block here, you can see the main menu of my blog at the top and by default most themes will show a default um, main menu with all the pages and maybe a home link. This is what you see here. So now I go in my admin area and I go to the customizer. That's great because then I can see a preview of my new menu and I can see better what's going on here. So I can see my block layout like this. And here in my customizer menu, I can see the tab menus and I'm going to click on this. And at the moment I only have a footer menu and um, I have it here on the bottom. And it's just one menu and I set it to all the footers, but this is just because it's a test block. So I show you how to create a new menu. You can just click on the add a menu button. And first you have to give your menu a name. So I call my uh, menu main and then I have to choose the location. And uh, for this, I will choose main menu. Every theme has uh, a number of options for menu locations. So it depends on the theme, what you will see here. But mainly the um, main menu is called main menu or primary menu or maybe header menu. So I choose my main menu here and now I can add menu items to my menu and I can see all my pages. So I will, um, I don't want the home link, but I just want to add my three pages. And then the great thing about custom menus is that I can not only show pages, but I could also include posts, categories, tags, and um, custom links, and even more options. It depends um, if you have something like WooCommerce active for an online shop, you could also add products and so on. So I also want to have uh, my travels category and then I look at tags. I don't have any tags at the moment, but I show you one thing and this is custom links, which is pretty handy. So here I could just add any um, kind of URL. I will choose the Elma Studio URL for this just to show you. So I include my URL here and then I can choose a custom link and add the menu item this way. So here now you can see that I can uh, that I added my pages and a category and a custom link and I can just reorder them by um, dragging and dropping them around. And what you see here now is that um, I drag the one menu item a little bit to the right and this will cause, um, this will create a sub menu. So you can just easily do this like so. And um, one last thing I have to do after I created all my items. Um, one more thing is I could also search for items like, for instance, if I have a lot of tags or I have a lot of categories, I can search for a specific one. So after I created my menu, I can just click on save and publish. And I don't, I will see my menu here in the preview, but after I've saved and published my menu, I will see it on um, the live blog site as well. So it will change here as you can see. And this is my drop down menu, my sub menu I created by just dragging this page one to the right a little bit. So it shows up here like this and that's a super easy way to create uh, custom menus for your website you could also create a custom menu for your footer or whatever menu areas your theme has and the great thing about doing it in the customizer is that you see what you're doing and you see your menus appearing already in the preview window. So I would definitely recommend that. Yes, and so this is how you create custom menus in WordPress in the customizer. If you have any question, please let me know in the comments. I uh, love to answer your questions and I hope this video was helpful for you. See you soon. Bye.